Introducing the horses, race number eight, the third and final division for the Hatfield Automall Pacing Series, leg number two. Stallions and Gildings racing one mile, purse of $3,000, no changes in this field of seven. The one is Mossy Creek, owned by Ken Rucker of Beecher, Illinois. Tony Morgan drives. Two is Dr. Einstein, owned by Don and Carol Lehman of Columbus with Terry Groves. Three, Scoot and Sam, owned by Don Hegler and Lowell Green of Ohio, Mike Wilder up. Number four, Table A, owned by Laura Baker of Galloway with Jeff Fout. Five is Chinese Rings, owned by Don Eggers of Wilmington, Dave Miller up. Number six, Sinjor Sam, owned by Tom Rose, Spencer and Wilbur Sindel of Ohio, Dean Collins drives. Seven is Impatient Spirit, owned by Jim Woodward of Groveport, Chip Noble in the Sonke. One play show, perfected trifecta, wagering eight minutes to post, eight minutes. Third division pacing stallions and gildings lining up behind the gate. They're on the back stretch. There they go. And uh, they're off. Chinese rings of powers away for the lead. Table A alongside is second. Far outside, impatient spirit getting underway early. Mossy Creek came off the rail fourth. Firing into the first turn, a big gap. Five of the inside, it's Dr. Einstein. Long the rail, sixth, Scoot and Sam, the trailer. Sinjor Sam, early speed duel. As they approach the first quarter mile marker, Chinese Rings has won the battle for the front. Mossy Creek settles in behind a second, and Impatient Spirit is caught uncovered. Racing third, first quarter, 27-3. and three. As they come to the stretch, Impatient Spirit will take command now and Mossy Creek is moving early on the outside and Mossy Creek charging to the front will take his turn on the front end. Impatient Spirit yielding on the inside is second. Chinese Rings remains third on the rail. Inside fourth to table A and here comes Dr. Einstein pressuring five as they approach the half. Sixth on the outside it's Scoot and Sam. The half 56 and four and Mossy Creek on the front end, we'll need a breather here, but here comes Dr. Einstein. Won't let him take that breather. He's there pressuring heavily. Down the back side they go, Mossy Creek leading by a neck. Dr. Einstein alongside is racing a second impatient spirit along the rail is third. Scoot and Sam drafting along with cover is fourth. Chinese rings shuffle back, buried five alongside a sixth at Sinjor Sam. To the outside comes Table A. Three quarters, 126 and three, and Mossy Creek hangs on to the lead by a neck. Outside a second, it's Dr. Einstein, an impatient spirit waiting for the super stretch with less than an eighth of a mile to go. And down the stretch they come, Mossy Creek with the lead. Outside, here comes Scoot and Sam. Further outside, Sinjur Sam, longest shot of the board in deep stretch. Outside, Sinjur Sam puts a nose in front and gets there in 156 and four. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing this evening's official winner, third division for the Hatfield Pacing Series, longest shot of the board, flying home to the outside, number six, Sinjur Sam, a four-year-old, a son of Simcoe Hanover, from BJ's Ragdoll by Pumpet. All by Thomas Rowe, Spencer, and Wilbur Sindel of Ohio, Dean Collins, the trainer and driver this evening, his first season's victory, doing it in a big way, tonight's mile, 156 and four-fifths. The complete order of finish, number one, Mossy Creek, three. Number two, Dr. Einstein, seven. Three, Scoot and Sam, two. Four, Table A, four. Five, Chinese Rings, five. Number six, Sinjor Sam, the winner.